In this mini tab presentation, we're going to start off by looking at some how to determine the uh, some descriptive statistics uh, for some numeric variables in our data set. So the numeric, the data set we're going to use is called Fish MTW. So there we have it. There it should be available on my website, and it comprises of a, 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 a a naming variable called fish, so just the names of the 40, uh, 14 types of fish, the price in 1970 and the price in 1980. What we're interested in right now is, later on we'll do some more um, elaborate advanced statistical analysis, but just right now I want to find out some uh, basic descriptive statistics for this. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go up here to stat, and this is the fifth uh, menu on the up at the top, and I'm going to click on basic statistics, and I'm going to go and click on display descriptive statistics and let's have a look at that I'm going to click on that now this has asked me going to uh, I've only got two numerical variables so that's all that's okay so I go to the, uh, select these two numerical variables here and so I'm going to select both of them highlight both of them down here I'm going to press on select okay so there they are there now let's see what statistics we can get with this well there's quite a lot here so there's trimmed mean tr some cumulative percentages, cumulative percentages, very coefficient of variation, there's quite a lot there. So I'm just going to uh, select a few simple ones. I'm going to deselect a few just to make a little the output easier to read but if you just sort of get a sense of how many are there there's actually quite a lot of uh, descriptive statistics that are available in uh, Minitab for looking at a data set and some like will be, can be very useful for example skewness and kurtosis and stuff like that. We're going to click OK on that and we also have a quick look at graphs. Let's look at graphs. There we can have a histogram, histogram with normal curve, individual value plots, and box plots. In this particular instance, let's just say for argument's sake, I want to have box plots of my data. I'm going to include that there as well. Box plots. So we're going to select that as well. Now, that is all the options I want. So let's go click OK now. Now, what we have here, first off, we have two numeric variables, and we have a box plot for each. So here's the box, box plot for 1980, and that's so far so good. It's a very straightforward enough box plot. That's grand. Um, let's just say for argument's sake, I have considered that and I'm going to move on. So I'm just going to close that down. One for 1970 as well. Okay, that's good. Move on from that. And here we have the... So here, what I'm going to look at now is the session dialog box. And here we have the descriptive statistics. Here we have the number of items in both cases, N and N. Here we have the mean the standard deviation, the mean, the standard of the standard error of the mean, the standard deviation, the Q1, the first quartile, the median, and the third quartile. Now that's the selection of descriptive statistics that I've opted for in this particular case. And I get there we have them for both variables. So for argument's sake, if you had more variables and you wanted to select a different set of statistics, that's grand. The thing is if you're have new, multiple numeric variables uh, you have to. You're picking the same set of statistics for all of the variables that you are looking at. So, anyway, in a nutshell, that's descriptive statistics and how you sort of go about looking at descriptive statistics. Just quickly remark here, we can store the descriptive statistics in variables. Um, so let's click on that. Just select that one. Okay. And that is stored here as the, in columns C4 and C5. Okay. So, uh, this is again, so if you want to sort of uh, uh, analyze uh, these uh, the data like this later on, that's how you would go about it. So you could store it like that. Okay, that ends our presentation on descriptive statistics.